Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. In this video, I will show you how you can install and run Linux right on your iPhone or iPad running iOS 18 without a jailbreak. The method shown in this video is completely free and we will be using a UTM which is also completely free and legit. First of all, I will show you how you can install UTM. You can easily install UTM by going to its official github page as you can see it right here you can simply scroll down you will go to releases where you will get the latest release simply scroll down and in assets you will have to get this utm.ipa to your computer first and then you can use sideloadly to install it to your device sideloadly is also completely free you can scroll down first of all install itunes from here then install icloud app and then from here you can install sideloadly simply open sideloadly and connect your device via usb hit this button to select the ipa for utm or you can simply drag it and drop onto side loadly then simply put in your apple id here any apple id will work hit the start button type in the password and it will install onto your device now to make it work open settings go to general scroll down to device management and from here simply trust the app also simply go back because on ios 16 or higher you will have to enable developer mode to use the app scroll down to privacy and security scroll all the way down and simply turn on developer mode from here you will only see developer mode after you have installed the app and now you will be able to open it and work with it the rest of the process is on device now that we have utm already installed we will have to enable jet or just in time compilation to make it run at full speed or it will be painfully slow so you can use jet streamer or side git server to enable jit for your apps which require jit so let's do it i will use jit streamer all right so i will select utm all right as you can see now utm is open with jit enabled we will hit the plus button and you can see we have jit enabled you can confirm it by this message because it is different if JIT is not enabled. Now from there, you can hit download pre-built from UTM gallery. Simply select it and it will take you here to the UTM's gallery. So in my opinion, the lightest version for Linux is this Debian 11 LXDE. So I will recommend using this one. We will select it and we will download the VM image from here, all right? but to save your time i have already downloaded it you can see it in my files app you'll find it here as you can see it right here now simply hit it and it will automatically unzip please don't worry this can take some time you may feel that it is frozen but it is not all right as you can see it is now extracted we will close out of files we will open utm again hit open then go to on my iphone downloads and you will see this right here simply select it then hit open you will land here you don't have to change anything you can change memory but it is set to 1 gb by default so i will leave it here just hit this play button you can see it will start to load you can simply turn it here it can take some time and it will eventually load it will ask you for the username and password so the username for this vm for this distribution for linux is debian so i will bring up the keyboard and type it here the password is also the same now i will log in this can take some time and it will eventually load you can see it is working without any issue the speed is really good we will also fix the resolution we will switch back to safari and here you can see the default username and password also which is publicly available and here you will find a command which will fix the resolution 
so we will just copy the command from here copy open utm again then we will bring up a terminal and then select paste bring up the keyboard then press return you can see that it has now fixed the resolution you can adjust it further by simply pinching and zooming just to your liking let's open the file browser you can simply select this and it will open up the file browser and you can work with it and if you want to shut it down we will simply select this log out and we can shut it down and UTM will automatically close. Now, if you want to delete the Linux VM, you can simply hit UTM. You'll find it here. You can swipe and delete to free up space. And now you can close out of it. And by the way, you can see my device version. It is running iOS 18.0.1. That's all for this video. If you still have questions, please ask in the comment section. And I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care of yourself.